I'm going into eighth grade, and this is gonna be a fun year. Go like this. You guys can probably not understand me since I'm like rubbing like this. <laughs> Welcome back to Nen Fan. Today I'm gonna be doing my morning routine. Today is the first day of school. I'm going into eighth grade and this is gonna be a fun year. So as you can tell, I just woke up. Uh, I woke up a little bit early just in case anything like happens. So let's get started. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna be using this cleansing water because I don't wanna wash my face. So I'm just gonna take this like pad thing and then I'm just gonna like, this pad like exfoliates your face. It's pretty nice. I'm just gonna rub it. And at the end, I don't know why. I'm kind of weird with like um school starts, but I like brush my teeth at the end. Okay. I'm good with that. Next thing, I'm kind of like on a weird schedule. Next thing, I'm gonna be using my B blush, and putting it on my eyelids. Okay. Now I'm gonna be doing my hair. I'm gonna show you how I do my hair. I cut it so it's a little bit shorter, so it's kind of different. I use this. I think it's a one inch. One inch comb and it has a clamp. So yeah. Okay, so when I curl my hair, I use this heat protective. I use this one. It smells good. And okay, I think I'm like the first one in the night to wake up. Actually my mom might be awake, but like out of all the kids, I think I might be the first one to wake up because like I'm not nervous, but I'm kind of scared to like find all my classes. So we're gonna just brush my hair out. I have a morning voice. I'm still like waking up. So I am gonna part my hair like that. So I split it in twos so I can get like my full head. And then I just like twirl it, twirl it, twirl it to just like kind of make a bun. And then I just like wrap it around my head, I guess. Comment down below if you guys like summer better or school. I definitely like summer better because I hate school. So I grab like this much hair, and then I grab my clamp, my curl hair, and I go like this. I bring it like that way, and I don't want it too curly, so I leave it there for like five seconds. And then I go down, and I do that again. And then I leave like this much out, because I like my edge. So it'll look like a twirly, and it won't stay like that. I brush it out at the end. So you're, you're just going to want to repeat that. Same thing, so you're gonna wanna go right here, come down, and yeah. Hopefully my hair turns out good because I was kinda worried about that because sometimes my curls are like weird. It's cause I curl the same way because I have no clue what I do. I just do and it kinda looks weird, but it's hard to go the other way, so I'll come back when I finish this half of my hair. Oh, and one more thing, if your hair gets too curly at the end, I usually just straighten the ends. And I just like go through it and like pretend like I'm straightening my hair and it, then you'll have like loose curls. Okay guys, so I'm on the other side of my hair and I'm gonna show you how I do it. So I just grab a piece like this much and I turn the clamp like the other way. So it goes like towards my face. I don't know, like that. It kind of looks weird, but it looks better at the end, I swear. Okay, I almost forgot to show you guys. So this is what it looks like. It kind of looks weird, but I straighten the ends, and when I brush it out, it looks all pretty. So we're moving on to the top. So I just take it down and put like the bottom half like in like a pony, I guess. Like in a, I don't know what you guys call it. Like, I just call it like pony. So my part looks really crazy right now. So we are going to do like a part, a straight part, and down the middle. That's where I do my part because I don't like the side part on my hair. So that's what it's gonna look like. So let's move on. Okay, so for the top, it has a little bit more hair. So I do like smaller pieces. This. I just do the same exact thing like I did at the bottom. I like different pieces. I only do one like curl thing because they're shorter. I'll show you guys when I am done with my hair. Okay guys, I am all done with my hair. Um, it is currently six. Uh, my alarm just went off. It's six, I don't know, you can't even see that. 
but it's six o'clock which is perfect because i have an hour left and i think i'm gonna like have 20 minutes like to have like free time i guess so here's my hair right now so i brush it out like this and then like i brush it in the back and then i come over here and i just like go like this just to like shake it like all out i guess i don't know if like that's the only me that does that but so my hair look actually looks kind of good today. So this is what my hair looks like. I'm going to straighten the ends. Oh, I put a lot of heat in my hair. I'm just gonna curl a couple more pieces on this side because this side is more curly than this side. So yeah. Okay, so it is currently six. As I already told you guys, and everyone is waking up. So this is what it looks like. It actually looks good. Um, I'm gonna be straightening the ends. Basically just gonna tell you what heat protectant does. So you spray heat protectant on your hair and like when you do your hair, when you put heat on it, it basically just burns off the heat protectant instead of just like burning off like what's in your hair, I guess. I don't know, I think that's right, but I may be wrong. So I'm straightening the ends like this and then straightening this side. I'll tell you what kind of straightener I use in a second. Okay. Now I'm gonna show you guys the back of my hair and you're gonna tell me if it's straight. I mean curled and like like looking good. <laughs> okay, so the lighting in my room is kinda dark, so hopefully you guys can see that. Okay, so when I do my hair, I just use this new oil. I think it's from Unite. It's really good for your hair, it makes your hair like healthy and like shiny and you only add a little bit to your ends or else it will make if you add it to the top of your hair it will make it like oily and look greasy which you do not want that but if you do want your hair to look oily at the top then i would add it to the top but you probably do not want your hair oily if you do then that's okay so i'm putting all my things away so i can have room to do my makeup i'm going to turn off all my curlers curler off straightener off so this straightener is a thing from walmart it's like con air i think i do not know how to say that but it's either from walmart or target so yeah now it's time to do my makeup okay guys so first thing when i wake up i just like brush my eyebrows out and like put like up my eyelashes like comb them up like that so first thing I use is like this oil for my skin. It like makes it like not so oily. I literally love this thing because it just feels like water is going in your face and it makes it like soft and like smooth. So I just add two drops to my cheek and then like I just spread it everywhere. You guys can probably not understand me since I'm like oh, like this. <laughs> So I rub that in, then I use like this filter primer thing, it's almost gone. I literally love it, it's from Tula. I just like put it on my cheek, down here, my nose, and my forehead. So I just put one, two, three, four, five dots. So I rub it in, it has like sunscreen in it, and it makes your face look a little bit tanner, which is nice, like in the winters and stuff. I got my nails done, so I asked for zebra print on the tip. And I was like, oh, I only want zebra print on the tip. And she did the whole nail, and then she had me put it in the light. So it was too late to tell her. So I just have to work with these nails, which are still pretty cute. They just, I don't really like the zebra, but it's okay. So first I start with concealer. I use this fit one. It, it's kind of old, so you can't really see. Gonna rub it on my eyes, on my side of my nose, and like right here above my lips. Okay, now we're just gonna rub. Bought like these little like sponge things, but like I use them and literally everything just goes onto the sponge. Like it all just comes off my face and just goes onto the sponge. You guys are wondering like why is it using the sponge? That's why. 
My face is looking pretty good so far. So next thing, I just use this butter bronzer. It's almost gone. I literally love it and it smells good. As you can tell, it's only on the sides and like the middle is all gone. But I'm just trying to use as much as I can of it because I can still get a lot of it like when it's almost gone. I'm not a professional like makeup artist, I guess. So if I'm doing things wrong, I don't really care because I just do my makeup like the only like of my routine so yeah oh also i forgot to add concealer on my eyebrows because i got a scar when i got my eyebrows done she like i don't know like cut them too deep or something so we're just gonna like blend right above there i think we've done pretty good so far so next thing we are gonna do is my mascara my mascara kind of takes a while, so that's where we're gonna do it. Okay, so I use this like spoolie thing from like a makeup um, kit, and then I use this like eyelash curler. So this is what I use, and then I use telescopic mascara. I definitely recommend this mascara. It gives you lots of length, and it is so good. I have two because I do two coats, and one's almost out, and then I use the fuller one for like extra thickness. Okay, so let's move on to my mascara. Okay, I'm gonna come back when I'm done with the first coat. So I'm done with the first coat. Uh, after I do the first coat, I just like to brush, brush out all the clumps. Okay, so it's kind of hard to see because I have mascara all over. So now we're gonna do the second coat. So I'll come back when I'm done with the second coat. Okay guys, I am done with all my mascara. As you can tell, I have a lot of on my eyes. I'm just using this cleansing clean water and I just add it on like this like that and then just like rub it all off i think i got it all it looks like i didn't because like it's the lighting in here it literally looks like everything is like black my eyes look black i mean they are but you know what i mean okay so sometimes when i do that they kind of get clumpy together so i do that I do the other side so i'll come back when the other side is done okay so i'm gonna add one extra layer because i'm afraid it's gonna be like because like my mascara kind of gets like faded away and so i'm gonna add one more extra layer because i'm gonna be at school for like seven hours so yeah okay i am finally done with my mascara now it's time to add some blush so i use this pixie stick it looks like that that's what i use and then it like comes off and it looks like that kind of looks like a little sunscreen and then you can like roll it up so i just like dab it on like where you usually put your blush i just put it like right there and then like go like this don't worry guys it'll look way better at the end when i blend it in and then i just add like two dots right there and then i use like this kind of brush like where it like goes up these are new i just barely caught them because i needed some so I just like dab it. Okay, so it's only 6.20, so we have like a lot of time. So I still need to like make my bed, brush my teeth, get ready, like put perfume on, deodorant, all that jazz. So I actually might not have any extra time because like I forgot I have to make my bed and I literally hate making my bed in the mornings. It looks like really red, but it actually like makes me look like a little bit summer instead of just like, like one color, like, with all that like foundation and stuff so i do that and then like the lighting in school like shines on you so i always like worry about that i don't know why but i like rub it off a little bit so there's not like too much you don't ever want too much blush because you will look sussy so we're just gonna wipe it off a little bit and then i just always use this to like remove my makeup so yeah next thing for my last thing i use this highlighter it's broken i literally have had this highlighter for like two years and it's literally the best broken and i just like rub it in on like my nose and then like in between my eyes and then i get like this brush and i rub it on my cheeks also you don't want too much highlighter so you want to make sure you rub it in all the way my morning voice is like cracky all the time so i just rub that in i'm going to be taking this brush to like blend it in so i think i am all done 
with my makeup. Now it's time to clean off my desk because it's a mess. It's literally a huge mess. Like you can't even see like one spot on my table. Okay, I'm gonna and clean this off and then I'll let you know what the next thing. Okay, now that I have cleaned off my desk and done my makeup, my hair, now it's time to brush my teeth. Okay guys, I brushed my teeth. Now it's time to go floss. Okay, now that I've cleaned my teeth, now it's time to floss them because it's 627. Okay, so I'm just gonna floss. Let me hurry and finish. Okay, now that I've done like flossing my teeth, I like moisturize my lips and I use this Aquaphor. I literally love it. It makes my lips so soft and I use it like literally every single day. It makes it look your lip like glossy and it makes them smooth and yeah, it just makes them look good. Okay, so my hair is done. We're just gonna like poof it up a little bit. My hair is done, my makeup's done. I brush my teeth and now it's time to make my bed. Okay, so I made my bed and then I sprayed some good smelling stuff on it. So every day, like every year before school starts, I always wash my sheets so that I can be in like a clean bed and that I can start my like week with a fresh new clean bed. Okay guys, so I have an outfit. I have like this green top and then these black jeans. So let me try this on for you guys and then this is what I think I might wear. Okay guys, this is the outfit. It's this green like tight top, with these black jeans, and I'm gonna try my shoes on with it and see what you guys think. Okay, these are my shoes. They're just like that. I don't know what one is better to have it like that one or that one. I'm gonna show you in the mirror what my outfit looks like. Okay, this is what it looks like. It's kind of hard to like see because my mirror's right there, but I like this outfit because it's simple and it's cute. I think I might wear this. Okay, we're gonna be doing a little foot check. So this shirt is from Hollister. These jeans are from Billabong. My shoes are from the mall. I don't know what the place is called. And my backpack's from Little Lemon. Okay guys, so I'm gonna be putting on some jewelry if I can. I think I'm gonna be wearing like this gold necklace. Let me hurry and put it on. Okay, I don't know if you can see that, but it's just like this cute little necklace. Now it's time to put on perfume. Okay, so I use this warm and cozy perfume from Pink. It smells so good. I literally just put it all over me, put it in my hair. Now it's time for deodorant. So I might get sweaties. It's the first day of school. I might be a little nervous from like all my classes and stuff. So I definitely recommend putting on deodorant on the first day of school. Okay, so I use this Old Spice. Fiji kind. It's like men's kind, but it actually like works really good. Okay guys, I am finally done getting ready and now I'm just gonna like take off the tags on my clothes. See if I can get the back one. Okay guys, it's seven o'clock. Now it's time for me to go downstairs, fill up my water bottle and eat breakfast. I'm saying goodbye to my room. Bye room. Okay, so no one is down here yet. I'm the only one down here. So now let's fill up my water bottle. This is the kitchen. Okay, so I need to hurry and dump up my water. Okay, so it's gonna take a minute for the ice to come out. So we are going to go outside and get ice. Okay, so I go outside. This is what it looks like when it is seven where we live. It is warm and yeah. So okay, this is our ice maker. Okay guys, we are done filling up my water bottle. Now it's time to make breakfast. I am having fruit, so I'm having strawberries, raspberries, and grapes. Okay guys, we are on our way to school. We are almost there. We are dropping off Paisley first, and then me and Sadie, and Lily doesn't have school till later, so yeah. Okay guys, we are at school. Um, I do not want to go to school at all. I hate school, but <laughs> we can do this. Um, thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe down below, give this video a big thumbs up, and follow us on all our social media. Bye!